hello everybody, welcome to the sound test room. Today we are taking a look at Keys of the 70s by Lost in 70s, who also make uh, like a Hammond organ, which we shall also be taking a look at in another video. And also some uh, very, very good guitar amps and stuff like that. So, thought I'd start with the uh, Keys of the 70s. If someone can let me know they can hear me okay, that, uh, that would be absolutely lovely. I'm running this in Nano Studio and shortly I shall apply some reverb. So you get quite a few controls. You get a tremolo, a stereo. Hi Joe, thank you. We have an ADSR, which means we can do some nice piano pads, which is lovely. Hi Stephen, hi Scott. We have a neat, let's take this out. We have a, a release as well, so it's actually nice without taking the reverb off. So it's a bit, it's not natural. But with a sustain pedal, it sounds. But it's still not natural when you take your foot off. But with a little tiny bit of uh, release, it's lovely. Hello Atto Z. Hi Sai. So we also have a reverb. Now I'm not a big fan of this reverb, but I will use other reverbs, but we have a lovely chorus and we shall try the chorus now. And we have an output volume which is lovely because it's set quite low and we can boost it up a little bit gives it a kind of a And it's not just a piano, by the way. We also have a, tr a tremolo and stereo. So if you're listening through headphones, you wouldn't normally put a tremolo on like an acoustic piano. But it's there if you want to. And then we have a, a tine. Okay, so tine's not gonna really, win to, unless we, until we get into the actual, the road kind, but. So we need to have the roads on for this, but we have to have drive. For, for low fang things up a little. Hi Brad, how are you? Hope you're feeling okay today. So the drive's nice, and you have different cap types as well. Thanks, darling. Okay, darling. Thank you. Just, just put me pop. Oh, that's better. I like that. I really like the drive. And 
last but not least, we have an EQ, which is very good. So if we do this, we can and put the drive on. We can make it sound like it's coming through a broken radio. Turn your volume down, future. I've, I've, that was a that was a, a mistake with the EQ anyway, but it won't happen again. So that's really nice. So we can turn a, let's get this back to some sort of. a glass of uh, sugar-free coke so there's a piano sound for you and the different controls now we also have um, we have a piano we have a, a logical EP uh, no for that that's kind of like a whirly so let's try that so I'm not gonna hear the tine in until we until we put in the stage that's when we can use the tine and it's really good. That's nice. So moving on, oh, that's sorry, uh, moving on, let's try the stage. And this is where we can bring in the time. It's a really nice sample set of sample piano. Oh yeah, be careful out there folks. Uh, 
Um, so let's turn the time on. Genius and Mike Post. on the time. Like I said at the beginning, you with the fact that it's got uh, the release and the attack means that we can make any any of these pianos into a really nice pad. Not the time, because that'll just be there. Actually, it's quite nice. Okay, so we also have a, cla a clavinet and which is really quite nice. Hi Kev. And then last but not least we have a, 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 vi a vibraphone. <clears throat> Help campers, uh, if you would like to uh, go to the dinner hall now.
Okay, so let's do something with it. Yes, let's. Hi, Jade. So on a bit of a do. One, two, three. Four, six, too fast. God, I tell you what, it's blinking windy here today. Not that kind of wind, but proper windy outside. Um, let me see. Let's try 10 the volume of that down a bit, shall we? Thinking metronome to do your editing. I'll put some sort of beating in a minute so uh, you're not having to suffer the <clears throat> uh, metronome. I think also in tonight's live stream, we'll be taking a look at the new Chord Jam app from Audio Modern. So, let's stop this. Let me do, I'll get some, uh, some some of that down to
<clears throat> there you go. There was sounds of sounds of the seventies. Sounds of the seventies. Very nice it is too. I don't know what went wrong there. I don't think I was supposed to put that there. I think I might have to. Um, do yeah, I know it's just supposed to go. Vor, what, what, vor. Move that there. I think that might be better. <laughs> Two of them, and then another one of these here. So if I'll just duplicate that there, and then I'll just um, move that section along there, like that. So that might sound okay, actually. So if we go from there. <laughs> Actually, uh, <laughs> do something else with that one. That's all right. Actually, I quite like. I like things like that, though. Anyway, oh, it's synth master, isn't it? Awesome. Hope it will all okay as well. Like I said, tonight we'll probably have a look at, uh, probably have a look at the new Chord Jam uh, app from Audio Modern. I think uh, Gavin's just done a big massive monster tutorial on it, so. But yes, I, it's, uh, this keys are the seven, they're, Keys of the, yes, keys of the seventies. I really like the clavinet. Obsidian. We just did that bass sound, and then we had roads. <clears throat> Lovely stuff. And this was a piano, and I put a bit of a uh, black hole on there. And with like I was saying with this, with this particular thing, a little tiny bit of release on the actual piano makes it much more kind of... I mean, I've got a sustain pedal as well, but...
It's quite a nice piano, you know. But you you, you need to put a bit of because the reverb isn't that great, but the sounds are cool. But the chorus is lovely, and the tremolo's nice as well. If you want a stereo piano, of course. You get carried away, it's, it's lush. It's lushness of the max. Guys, I will I will I will continue with this actually and I will make some more uh, adjustments and things to it as well. I think I might extra uh, just, just double lap it up as well. And then we can kind of just kind of start to as it's kind of um breaking down Let's see what that sounds like and then i will actually make adjustments to this i think gosh i love nano studio so much for this kind of stuff anyway let's see what that sounds like shall we uh, guys i'll let you say ta-da to each other while this track is playing i'm gonna take up yeah i took it off loop haven't i um, i'm gonna take um loop where's my loop gone play i'm gonna disable loop mode and just play it from the beginning guys thank you so much for joining me this afternoon um where we took a look at the keys of the 70s um which is this here very nice it is too very nice awesome stuff sounds lovely let's have a listen to this track shall we uh, and i will see you later probably probably with chord jam yes probably with chord jam if you want a deep dive tutorial i think gavin's just done one so go and check that out if you want and uh, yeah, we'll have a mess with it later. Ta -ta.